Welcome to this week's episode of Mid-States Wrestling. This is the Loose Cannon, David McBee, and I'm joined by the governor, Nigel Rapp. On this week's episode, we've got Warren Adams squaring off against Colton Theron Vaughn. Brittany Hotland will be joining us on commentary. And in tag team championship action, the champions, Toxic Masculinity, will defend their titles against the fraternity. And we're gonna get a few words from Scott Hansen after his crushing defeat to Sam Stackhouse. What's happening to you, Handsome? What's happening? Handsome Scott Hansen, Stephen E, manager of champions. I think it's about time that we have a talk. Ladies and gentlemen, the following match has a 15 minute time limit and is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, he weighed in at 175 pounds from Matheson, Massachusetts. This is Warren Adams. Warren Adams now making his way to the ring and the class act has had some really great performances here in the Mid-States Arena. Yes, and speaking of great performances, we are joined here at the broadcast table by none other than the leader of the Rabbit Empire, Nigel Rabbit. Nigel, uh, th thank you for joining us. You're welcome. Thank you for appreciating my greatness. Unfortunately, uh, <clears throat> I'm not so sure about the appreciation from uh, other parties at this table. Wrestling Arena erupts because it is must-see TV time. Colton Theron fought. Yeah, and speak of energy, this man is like a firecracker. And look at this, the fans, the fans love him. He draws his energy from the fans, and he's got a lot of it. Well, he is ultra-athletic. Uh, he's very amped, very, very amped. His enthusiastic greeting of the small people will probably have a, 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 a hearing loss in their later years. Uh, well, there's always that dark, that dark path to go down, I guess. <laughs> but look at this. Of course, he had the 2023 match of the year versus Luke Langley. And now he's ready to make this year the year of Colton Theron Vaughn. Mid-States Wrestling here in Harrison, Arkansas, alive for Must See TV. Speaking of Must See TV, you can always check us out every Friday night on YouTube, Mid-States Wrestling, for new episodes. Yes, new episodes drop. If you want to uh, see Must See TV live, grab those tickets. QR code scan right here on your screen or go to mswtickets.com for tickets, merch, and more. Look at this. He's got, the ban he's got his bandana on. Warren Adams is, is ready to go. Kind of surprised Whoa. at this strategy, trying to take on the mixed martial arts superstar. Colton Theron Vaught. I feel like this is a, a, a right now it's all this is their test of strength. This is this is what that is. Well, Warren Ar Adams told me earlier he's been watching Cobra Kai on Netflix, so now I think he thinks he's trained to be a uh, MMA star. Hmm. Take it. Perhaps maybe he should consider watching Mortal Kombat. Oh, look at this and. This doesn't seem wise. Okay. Okay, we're feeling we're feeling it out. Oh, but CTV locking in that headlock. <laughs> Warren Adams not not having a great time right now. I think the class act just made a big mistake there. I I, I think he wants school to be out of session right now. <laughs> what a kick! Oh God! What a German suplex! Look at 
the speed of fun! Yeah, don't blink! This may be over in a flash. Cover! One, two, three! There you have it! Alas, poor Warren, I knew him, Horatio. A fellow of infinite jest of, oh, oh no, he survived. He's walking out, oh, never mind. Fans, thank you so much for joining us for another episode of Mid-States Wrestling. For our producer, Chris Blasky, and my broadcast colleagues, David McGree, Ryan Lee, and Nigel Rabbit, I'm Brittany Helen. We will see you next time on Mid-States Wrestling. You don't sign off for me. KC Insurance wants to remind everyone that we are your local trusted insurance agency for all your life and health insurance needs. We are located in the Northfell Shopping Center at 912 Highway 6265 North in Harrison. Feel free to come by the office anytime Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. or call 870-517-1207 to schedule your appointment now. And don't forget, we are local people helping local people. It's the Space Cowboy Jason Jones and I'm standing here with the one and only Jerry the King Lawler and hey, another Jerry. How do? And we're coming to Jonesboro, Arkansas on Saturday, June 29th. We got any other surprises in the store, team? Well, let's see. Team, uh, I'm a surprise. I'm a surprise. <laughs> Jimmy be there. Harden's going to be there, too. Can you make Jimmy Lawler? Jimmy Lawler, Jimmy Calhoun. The band's back together again. The band, the band's right. back together. We're going to Earl Bell and you press up there. Hundreds and hundreds of times. Hundreds of times, and it's going to be nice to be back. And what's so, so great is to see all the great wrestling fans that go to the It's great. We've got it loaded down. You're going to sign autographs, take photos. Calhoun, you're going to be there? I'm going to be there. It's been a long time since I've been in Georgia. My favorite referee! But, uh, <laughs> and he's going to be here, too. And Fantastic Jimmy's going to host. Duo. Jimmy's going to host. Oh, and we're going to have a blast. You didn't know that, did you? We'll see you guys Saturday, June 29th. Get your tickets at MSWTickets.com. I am Alan Jefferson, this is Cannonball Matthews, and we are the fraternity. Now everybody knows that we belong at the top of the mountain in Mid-States Wrestling. And last week, I was trying to take the high road and appeal to the courts to have that done. But it looks like we're going to have to do it ourselves. Toxic masculinity, you know those tag team belts should belong to us. And you know that we are not afraid to do anything it takes to claim them. Cannonball, you let them know exactly what we're willing to do. Toxic masculinity, you stole those belts from us and we are willing to do anything to earn what is ours. You know it was stolen. We are going to break your backs and climb over your bodies to reach the peak of the mountain. The fraternity is coming because we are smarter than you, we are stronger than you, and we are better than you. Boys, let's talk for a second. You two are probably the best tag team in mid-states, except for us. When we came to mid-states, there was no tag division. Me and Lightning here built it from the bottom all the way to the top. So you want to talk, and you want to talk, and you want these titles so bad? Or here's your chance. Earn them tonight. Prove just how good you are. Wrestling fans, it's the Space Cowboy, and guess who's with me? It's the mouth of the South, Jimmy Hart. Legends of Memphis Wrestling. It's going to be unbelievable. It's going to be on June the 29th, Jonesboro, Arkansas. Right. I love Jonesboro, Arkansas. At the old Earl Bell where you guys used to tour all the time. What a great time. Jerry the King of is going to be there. King. Coke will be where. Wildfire Tommy Rich. Tell the rest of them. so many of them. Doug Gillard, Bushwhacker, Luke, Downtown, Bruno, oh, Coco, yeah. beware. It's loaded up, and the mouth of the South is your host for the evening. So don't miss out, Jimmy. You I might even keep on dancing, baby. Woo! MSWTickets.com. KC Insurance wants to remind everyone that we are your local trusted insurance agency for all your life and health insurance needs. We are located in the Northfell Shopping Center at 912 Highway 6265 North in Harrison. Feel free to come by the office anytime Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. or call 870-517-1207 to schedule your appointment now. And don't forget, we are local people helping local people. Wrestling fans, it's the Space Cowboy Jason Jones, and I'm standing with the one and only rock and rolling Ricky Morton. What's going on, Ricky? Man, I'm telling you what, you know, the last time I've been in Jonesboro, Arkansas, I can't remember myself. 
But it ain't because I'm old. It's just been a long time ago. But it's you know, I remember back in the days, man, we went there every Saturday night at the Legion Building. Uh, some of the greatest memories I've, I'll have in my life, especially with my dad. My dad was a referee there in Memphis and used to bring me. But see, this time, I'm going to be the dad and I'm going to have my son, Kerry Morton, is going to be with me. We were going to be in tag team action that night. Now, a lot of people have asked me about Robert Gibson. Robert's still around. Robert just had his hip replaced. But Ben and Jones will mean so much to me. I kind of got lost there for a minute. But could you believe after all these years, starting out in Memphis, Tennessee, Robert and I, uh, been tag team partners for 40 years, but now I get to get to spend time like I did with my dad, time that I cherish so much that I wish that I had one more minute to do it again. So I'm looking forward to coming to Jonesboro, see all you folks over there. It's going to be a lot. Jimmy Hart's going to be there. David Schultz will be there. Coco will be where? Jerry Cow. Ooh, and uh, the King, baby. I got you. Ricky Morton's going to be there Saturday, June 29th. Earl Bell, get your tickets now. MSWTickets.com. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is sponsored by KC Insurance. This match is for the Mid States Wrestling Championship. This match is a call. Nigel Rabbit, I noticed on that petition, it looked to me like, you know, except for you and Stephen E., the rest of the signatures all have the same handwriting on it. I don't think you need a Actually, I am a notary. That doesn't make you a signature analyst. What? That makes you a notary. When it's You've got a stamp. None of his signatures are notarized, Nigel Rabbit. And the Sarah Poets, they waited at two times. They are your girlfriend's favorite wrestler, Johnny Lightning, the Lit Dudes, Johnny Dynamite. They are your reigning and defending Williams The Mid States Arena, they love the Johnnies. The Johnnies, they have defended those belts all over the United States with pride. And they're an example of probably one of the best tag teams in America today, Come Nigel Rabbit. This feud has been simmering as Cannonball Matthews, the vending machine with arms, rips the belt away. You gotta earn those, big boy. Gentlemen, we finished this! Here we go. Tag team wrestling at its finest. No wonder you like toxic, toxic masculinity, body shaming, a fine human being like Cannonball. Referee Jay Wild holding up those prestigious Mid-States Wrestling Tag Team Championship belts. Look at those. Those things are beautiful, McBee. Oh, incredible belts and toxic masculinity. Of course, the aerial American Alan Jefferson, a one-time fan favorite who turned his back on the fans. 
partnered up with the guy from Better Than You University, which we're still researching. I mean, you're still researching. I can't find any Better Than You University. That's because you don't get them. They're better than you. But only allow the people that are better than what, what did you just say? They're what? They only allow the people that are better than No, 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 that's not what you said, Nigel. You said that they are, they are better than who? Okay. Well, Cannonball retracted on what you said. Cannonball did show me his degree one time, and it's actually signed Cannonball Matthews. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. The aerial American crawling across the ring as here comes Johnny Dynamite, Cannonball Matthews. Look at these shots back and forth. One of the hottest feuds right now in Mid-States Wrestling. The fraternity, toxic masculinity. They took the tag team game here in Mid-States Wrestling to all new heights. Wow. Turn a Cannonball Matthews chest to hamburger meat. Looks like it was maybe 93-17, Nigel. 93-17. I'll tell him you said that. Fuck the people on his name. As now the Aerial American has checked back in this despicable petition that he's been carrying around with. Now, now, since when is being able to petition something despicable? I mean, you have, you have no tolerance for other people and their views. Alan Jefferson turned his back on the fans and... Oh, and the fans are so perfect, aren't they? I mean, they support toxic masculinity. We know, toxic masculinity we know how this... is the number one problem in Mid-States wrestling today. You gotta be kidding me, Nigel. So you're telling me the tag team, who is basically a trio with their, their clipboard or whatever you call it, you're just not making sense, Nigel. Sometimes, sometimes I agree with you, other times I don't. I'm, I'm, I'm at a loss for words, Nigel. That, that just proves the fact that you've never been the better than. Look at this chemistry. Well, here's the thing. I'm sorry to cut you off, oh, David. We've, fine, we've discussed fine. this how many times? Nobody can find anything about this better than you universe. It doesn't even exist. No, it, it, it's better than you universe. Automatic telling machine machine. For the fraternity, they're in trouble. Well, I tell you what, if you can get a scoop, if you can get a scoop on, you know, where that's at, I, I'd like to know more about it, Nigel. journalist, I can get scoops on anything. Well, please do. I'd like to learn more on the situation. Wow! I don't talk about the situation. I try to keep the out of my mouth. My name! I might not agree with his uh, his college education, but man, Cannonball Matthews is definitely bringing it. And toxic masculinity, they're in firm control. We'll be back here in a minute here on Men's States Wrestling. Casey Insurance wants to remind everyone that we are your local trusted insurance agency for all your life and health insurance needs. We are located in the Northfell Shopping Center at 912 Highway 6265 North in Harrison. Feel free to come by the office anytime, Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. or call 870-517-1207 to schedule your appointment now. And don't forget, we are local people helping local people. Check out Mid-States Wrestling on YouTube. New episodes every Friday, plus promos, backstage interviews, and more. Don't miss a single episode. Check out Mid-States Wrestling on YouTube. Subscribe now. Get your MSW merch at MSWTickets.com. Pick up this Japanese Respect shirt or this 1990s retro logo tee. Plus, get DVDs from past shows. Scan the QR code for event tickets, merch, and more. Check out MSWTickets.com. We're back here at Mid-States Wrestling and the fraternity have just been punishing Johnny Lightning during our commercial break. A double team action there from the fraternity. I mean, anybody that has hair that harkens back to 80s hair that really, really deserves to be punished. I mean, I mean come on, come on. Look 
how bright red Johnny Lightning's face is. And a huge right hand from Cannonball Matthews, and here comes Jefferson almost foaming at the mouth right now. He is sick and twisted. But I will compliment him. Good teamwork by the fraternity. Ever wonder that maybe, just maybe, the Johnny's names aren't actually Johnny and Johnny. And that perhaps they just named themselves the same thing so that the fans wouldn't be confused when it came to chanting for them. Where do you come up with this stuff, Nigel? I just come on, wait, come on. Which is more than I think the room does. Well, Matthews just launches Johnny Lightning. There's that collegiate background of Cannonball Matthews. He was a member of the Terminator Wrestling Academy in his youth. And if anybody knows anything about youth wrestling, man, that academy is a standout academy. Is there actually a record on that? I don't believe anything I hear from Cannonball Matthews. That's actually a record, you know, that's that, that's all true there, Big B. That body punch from Cannonball just leveled lightning. Guys, are we gonna have new champs here as the fraternity? I mean, for all the things I've said about him, they are delivering right now, just showing good teamwork. I mean, what if, what if Dynamite what if Lightning can't strike? Lightning, he's going up. It's a very valid point, Nigel. And he's going down. Oh! He may have lost a molar with that knee to the mouth. Any more teeth in are in this room. Well, this match is uh, brought to you by Casey Insurance. He's going to need to check with them on Monday with it. Make sure he's got a good dental plan. Well, might need a good medical plan. Because uh, look at this. Oh, oh, oh. oh, beautiful double team maneuver. Using your partner as a ballistic weapon. Lightning needing to make a tag in the worst way. We've talked about the intensity of Cannonball Matthews. This man has really found himself here in, in, in recent history in mid-states wrestling. He's got a mean streak, and man, he hasn't looked back since. And neither is his tag team partner, Alan Jefferson. I, and I don't think that they've needed to. No, they've, they've been a very cohesive tag team. And there's Lightning fighting off the big man. He's going to the top rope. He's going to fly shots the elbow. Connects, but Cannibal team to at least roll a little bit. Maybe he may turn it into a action blow. We'll see. Well, he's needing to make a tag in the worst way. He's been in there for quite a while. Dynamite's trying to get the crowd to get Lightning fired up to make a tag. The tag to Jefferson. Here comes Johnny Dynamite. Oh! Jefferson hit. He got him up, guys. He got him up. Very impressive. Look at the lit fuse. He is on fire. Burning hot. Oh. Super kick. German. And a two oh. count. Oh. Wow. How in the I world? I thought they retained right there. Well, see, the problem is, is that you assume. And you know what happens when you make an assumption. Let's be honest, Nigel. This is professional wrestling. Anything can happen at any time. Oh. And it just did. Lightning taking out Dynamite. Our official's checking on Dynamite. Looks like he got his belt rugged. Look at Alan Jefferson. Oh! Look at, oh! He just got caught red-handed with that petition. Tables have turned. The tables have turned. Oh, is that two count? Kidding me? What a show! No! 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 Way! Thank goodness! Two and nine tenths from having a new Mid-States Wrestling Tag Team Champion. I don't know what my heart rate is at, gentlemen, but it's through the roof. 
Wow! You should get yourself a concern. I might have to. Lightning still alive, trying to make the tag. Unable to get. And, it, and look at Matthews. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! Slams him on the hardest part of the ring. Actually, that's the second Oh, and look at the aerial American. Look at the smile and the look on the face there from the aerial American, Alan Jefferson. Lightning is down here. He makes a tag. Here comes Cannonball Matthews. Oh, oh, dynamite barely stirring on the outside. This is not looking good for toxic masculinity, gentlemen. Oh, oh great move by Lightning. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I was wrong. This is a super kick. Into the steel. There's that steel post you were just talking about, Nigel. Are you kidding me? Smashed his head in between that and the steel post. What a worthless human being Alan Jefferson is. I don't know about that. I'd say that he's pretty valuable right now. Look at the strength of Matthews. Picking up dead weight. Here comes off the top rope. Are we going to have new champs? We just might, David. Oh, look out. <laughs> this arena is shocked. New champ. New champ. New champ. Nigel Rabbit just shocking events here as the fraternity take the belts off of toxic masculinity. Talk about justice. Talk about the order of state. That's right. The baddest tag team in mid state history. This is all of you. All of you. This is it. Forever. The fraternity. The tag team champions. I think you you're going to see a lot more set to life in this year. Why is this? This is wonderful. God, we are never going to hear the end of this. Oh. Say it again. Oh, you think maybe the petition will be saved? Ladies and gentlemen, once again, your winners of this match. And new. The new. Fraternity. That's going to do it here at Mid States Wrestling. This is the Loose Cannon, David McBee. Of course, we are joined by Ryan Lee and uh, 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 Nigel Rabbit here on commentary. What tell you about closing out for you? And I'm Nigel Rabbit. That's McBee. That's Ryan. And Chris is the fella that runs the show. Chris Blasky, our producer. And we'll see you next Who's time here on Mid States Wrestling. <laughs>